our group member uh, which is uh, Muhammad Iqbal Aiman bin Muhammad Azman Muhammad Shafiq bin Zaidi Nur Aiman Fazulillahi bin Ayub So um, I want to introduce our project Okay, Our project um, is uh, basically uh, I can say a calculator Okay, A calculator is not a device uh, Not a specific device A calculator is a word uh, describing that the, um, to help people uh, or to assist human to calculate something okay Cal calculator are simple easy use tool with origin dating back over 5000 years ago so napier bones have made the bones so the bone function are thin rod which are is the inscribed with multiplication table and the user determine their sum by changing the vertical alignment of the rod and horizontally reading the multiplication table while this device greatly assists calculation they were not the calculators yet so um for me this is calculator um not a device as a calculator so uh, the end um, um we know that um the first calculator I made is a abacus abacus is from china china has made a calculator this system can perform common operation such as addition subtraction multiplication and division so china still use a basic abacus system so the benefit of uh, abacus is have a better understanding of the mathematical process than someone who depends on calculator oh. so um, we, um, for why we use uh, why we make this uh, uh, type of uh, programming about calculator so uh, calculator have not only greatly enhanced our ability to perform the regular computation that involve in every li everyday life but provide human with the ability to understand mathematical on a greater scale okay for uh, long ago uh, we have many type of calculator so uh, there is a big not a small pocket calculator it's very hard to bring everywhere so in this project we create coded algorithm to calculate cgpa for normal college student which has function input student and data and calculate the average of the grade so our uh, our project is to calculate the cgpa for students okay uh, so um we just need to put a grade um, every subject and the uh, and the calculator function is to calculate or uh, to predict all the uh, what is the final uh, pointer you will get soon so the, this is function of our uh, project so um, that's all from me I pass it to I pass to next presenter Okay, uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, My name is Muhammad Iqbal Aiman Wibu Azman My metric number is CN100158 So I will continue with the presentation on the project flowchart So uh, this is our project flowchart on the uh, CGPA measure. So as you can see here, uh, firstly we have to uh, The flowchart starting with start and then get score And then uh, the score is uh, we have to put uh, between A until F So uh, if the score is not uh, being uh, insert so it it will it will require us to get the score so if the score if the score is a uh, you uh, you will uh, get the pointer of 3.67 so if no uh, down below you have to, uh, you will get uh, the score is uh, a minus so if a minus you get you will get the score 3.33 next uh, so if the score is B plus and yes you will get you will get the uh, the score of uh, pointers uh, three. So next, okay. Uh, so if the score if the score is B, so yes, uh, the pointer is uh, two point six seven. So if no, uh, down below you uh, the score is B not B minus. So if yes, uh, the score the score is two point three three. So if no from the score B minus, uh, the score is C plus. So if the score is C plus, is yes, the pointer is two. And then uh, if not, uh, the score is C. Um, the 
pointed is 1.67 and then uh, if the score is C minus and is yes, if yes is the score is 1.33 and uh, D if D plus and yes the score is 1 and if D is yes if yes the score is uh, 0 0.67 so lastly if the score is D minus and this, uh, if yes uh, the score is 0 0.33 and lastly uh, if the score if F and yes uh, you get the score of 0 0.00 and then N so the grading system used in this format is uh, used uh, commonly is in Malaysia so however the style of coding focus on calculating the GPA that has been marked so the system kit hence uh, calculating average so next Please open your mic, Shafiq. I'm oh, sorry. So for the next, so for the next present, I will explain about the programming uh, that have been coding at the code blocks. First of all, we use multiple operator in the system, probably such as sum, double, and string. To create the system, we actually use the double because it easier to calculate more than one point. Uh, as example, four point zero three point six seven. That as we mentioned earlier, the double uh, can come that uh, doesn't matter actually how we choose because actually how we put the coding is that matters. So in our scale. We use the grading system that has been used in Epidemic Expo uh, or in Russia Scholarna in MNA. So when we grade, uh, when we get our grade, we actually receive that in A, A minus. We don't receive that in such as uh, G point uh, like G point zero zero. So when we get that, we want to calculate the whole semester. So what we do is we put uh, a pointer that we should receive to calculate the whole semester performance. So, next operator. For the next operator, uh, it's all about calculating inside the system before we ask for the input. So, in the system, we actually so in the system, we actually ask to to the user input the temp as in quiz one. So the output will be saying it scale or grade score. And next, after that, we will close it by using return. And next, we actually use the operator such in uh, calculating an average. So what we do is uh, we accept the summation of those operator and then we will, uh, we will divide it. So we will get average from the system. Next, we ask for the input. Uh, as you see, the I mentioned now. Here, we ask for the student uh, number, uh, like in a metric number, the identification. And then we ask also for the size of the attempt. I mean, how much, how much do you take the test for? Uh, it's like we, we have to attempt, so we will input two input in the system. So, next, we print out the cost and the attempt or that the student have taken. So, when they print out the answer, it will print out the cost name and the average grade for that uh, semester. So, let's see the programming. And build it. So total number of students is one. Study ID one process or so on. Let's say BNJ and then one to test. We say number of attempt. So we put the attempt for one A and then the second attempt, which is we get C. So we get um, our so I don't want to explain more because the uh, either result. And now we explain it in much more detail. So that's all for me. Now we move to Ivan.
Okay, Assalamualaikum, my name is Nurema Kratulia Himayu. As for the result, uh, at the left side is for the result for uh, total number of uh, a group or class, and on the right side is uh, for for one student. So, for example, uh, when the when we enter it for a student, which is one a person, and uh, we enter the student ID number one, and the total total number of course also one, and the course name we can put anything like BNJ or BNF, but we we have set to CS one one one. So the course name is uh, the, for the course name we use split operator where the value cannot be changed uh, because we has we have set the detail uh, in our coding by James uh, for the for the number of atom we uh, we choose uh, a array operator a string operator where the value can can be changed uh, for any any atom but but we have set to for atom for the for the scaling scaling gradient grading for the scaling gradient system we use core from 4.0 until at to until zero uh, next for the for the submission of all the four items is we get 4.34 and lastly the Average grade of this for item is 2.17. Uh, that's all for me. Thank you.